Hello, I'm Jo Holy, the Principal of the Rental Specialists, and this is a COVID-19 update for landlords, tenants, and other stakeholders in the residential tenancy space. You may have tuned in to the Prime Minister's address last night, which briefly touched on tenancies that may be impacted due to COVID-19. The announcement was very brief, and in essence, all he said in relation to residential tenancies was that there would be a moratorium on tenancy evictions. He then went on with the rest of his statement and discussed commercial tenancies. His brief statement did not shed any light on what the expectations will be in relation to the residential rental arrears for the duration of this COVID crisis, and we're still waiting for further confirmation from the state government and the real estate governing bodies. For now, the limited information we have taken from the announcement is this. Residential tenants will not be able to be evicted if they are experiencing financial hardship solely due to COVID-19 for the next six months. Our understanding of a moratorium is that this is a postponement of eviction. It is not that rent isn't required to be paid. Rent still needs to be paid. We've read the New South Wales Government COVID-19 Legislation Amendment Emergency Measures Bill it's a bill that allows the state government to make emergency changes to certain acts of parliament. Schedule 2 at 2.17 of the Act in summary enables the Minister to make emergency and temporary changes to the Residential Tenancies Act in order to a prohibit the recovery of a premises in particular circumstances, b prohibit the termination of a residential tenancy agreement in particular circumstances, c prevent or regulate the exercising or enforcement of another right of the landlord, and d exempt a tenant from the provision of the Act. It's the detail of the implementation of this Act that we're eagerly awaiting. Only then will we know how both residential landlords and tenants will fare in these crazy times. If you have a residential tenant who's asking for a rent reduction, reach out to us and we'll send you a hardship application form that you can ask your tenants to complete so you can then be fully informed of your tenant's situation and have a constructive conversation with them. As you can appreciate, this is our initial understanding of, of the announcement and new information will come to light as soon as the state government advises us further. We'll update you every step of the way and as always, we are here to help you if you require any clarity, assistance or further information.